Normal everyday friends catching up over a cup of coffee, but it's not as it seems. All these people live with diabetes and are the human face of academic diabetes research at the University of Warwick. The university consults them and in turn they advise the academics on the best way of taking forward their research ideas. Call them community consultants if you like. Because there's mutual support isn't there? And share, mutual shared experience. And um, I suppose it's helpful to know you're not unique. You feel as though you're putting something that can be helping other people that have got the diabetic, that are diabetic. As I don't have diabetes, living with diabetes because of my husband has meant it can make a, a lot of difference to a whole family in some instances. Having a user group means that people that know what it's like are advising them. You've got to uh, act as a resource for the researchers so that they can understand a little bit more what uh, the problems are with diabetes. I've got type 2, I meet people who've got type 2 and type 1 and I know what it's like to have the condition. Some of the researchers are young, they've never met diabetes other than it's a word and I can put them right on what diabetes is all about in the same way they can put me right on what research is all about and this is the way the two-way conversation and change of ideas between us and this is why the user group is so important. To find out how the group's experience helped research on a practical level I caught up with Dr Jackie Sturt, Assistant Director of Research at the University of Warwick. This is why it's really important. The user group have, have been involved in the diabetes manual right from the outset. This programme will help people develop skills and confidence in managing with their diabetes. And the user group were in at the, in at the very idea and they've been with this programme right the th way through. We're four years on now and, and we now have a programme with some evidence that it does in fact help people to develop skills and develop their confidence. So is Warwick University pioneering this research? Lots of researchers around the country are trying this to do this because it's health policy. But what's unique about Warwick, and we really think think we are unique in this respect is that we work in an ongoing way with people with diabetes. You know we've been around now since 2001 and we've got very established and trusting relationships with, with users, with people with diabetes and so every time there's a new research idea it just goes through this cycle of consulting with them and receiving their advice and making changes and we have developed research and, and interventions that will help them to manage their diabetes. Who would have thought it? These people are pioneering patients. So those days are long gone where all medical research was done up in those ivory towers. At Warwick University they're going firmly grassroots with the Diabetes Warwick user group instrumental in getting the recipe right for dealing with diabetes. Hmm, I think I'll have the chips.